Hi everybody, it's Mike in here. Um, this is a 30, 36 minute uh, interval class. Um, it also includes your cool down and a really good stretch. So um, you're probably going to be working for about 27, 28 minutes um, of interval. So all these things to remember, uh, listen to your body, never sick or dizzy. We're going to be working sort of between that seven and nine um, on your uh, PRE, so your perceived rate of exertion. So scale of one to 10, you're gonna work in that seven to nine range, um, getting water whenever you need it and always doing what you can. Okay, everybody, so let us get started with our warm up. So 90 to 100, just get moving, set your watches. So that nice, even pedal stroke. We just want that body to warm up just so it can be ready to work hard. Okay, whatever that hard looks like for you today. So you're pushing out through the ball of your foot, your hands are at your one or your foot. So we're going to be working through some intervals or hits. We've got three different ones with a minute rest in between each group, okay? So your first one will be eight at 30 seconds of hurt, and then 15 seconds rest in between each of those 30 seconds. So we'll have a minute break after that. Then we'll be doing a four by 60 with 20 second rest in between each. We'll have a minute rest in between that, of course, keep it moving. And then we'll do six by 45 second efforts with 15 second rest in between each one. We'll have our cool down and then our stretch. Okay? So just a heads up on what is to come. So you get to sort of mentally prepare yourself. Just make sure we're hydrated. heart rate is gradually increased. Deep breaths in and out. And before you can always increase your level or your gear, your tension. This is we're going along. Remember to work at your level. So if I say go hard, let's go hard for you. Never stick your dizzy. Scale one to ten. You're gonna work at a ten for really, really, really short amounts of time, like 15 seconds kind of things. And again, you should never be sick or dizzy. Yeah. Keep going. That nice 90 to 100 just warm up. Think about touching in those elbows. Always have space between your ear and your shoulder. So you don't lose that neck. Okay, so let's get ourselves ready. Our first interval we're gonna start. So getting a quick drink while you get yourself ready. Good. First one, let's stand it up. Good. So anywhere, 60 to 80. Enough here. Hands up high on the bars. Bum back over that saddle. We're getting right into it. Push and pull right up through the ball of the foot. Tummies are in. 30 seconds of work. 15 seconds of active rest. Always moving. You don't want to stand, stick, but keep moving. Two, two, Have a seat last year. Spin it out. So we're going to do that 70 to 80 seated, okay? Add your gear when you're ready. 
70 to 80 push. Come on. Feel that work, you're climbing, but you're kind of attacking that climb. Every pedal stroke. Three, two, have a seat, spin it out. 15 second rest. Add some gear, we're gonna do that. 60 to 80 again, seated. Three, two, let's go. 60 to 80, push. Here. 
my needle hundred, you guys. Spin in and out. We have one minute here. Good stuff. Just that one minute. 50 seconds. So nothing crazy. Grab a drink. Using that more um, minute to bring those heart rates down a bit. Good. So the next set, four at a minute each. These are going to be four sprints. So it'll be your seated, say 95 to 110, okay? We can do it. Ready? Five minutes, five seconds, four, three, two, one, and go. Let's go, guys. 90 to 110, and up here, you want your legs to never get away from you. You're in control of them, enough gear. That's how you're gonna work harder. You can help to evolve your foot. Each one is a minute with 20 seconds rest in between. You can do this. Halfway there, 30 seconds left, come on. Shoulders are away from those ears. Beauty. Fifteen seconds left. Come on. Three, two, last gear. Twenty seconds rest. Slow it down. Take it down to the rest. Breathe. Get that heart rate back a bit. Ten seconds left. And then we're going to do it again. 95, 110. Three, two, let's go. Good stuff. You got it. So at 95 to 110. You're working hard. About seven to nine. I'm working at about an eight. Just to change it up because those pills, they push me into my nine, right? Halfway there. Halfway there, guys. Beautiful. Don't lose those necks. 15 seconds left, you guys. Don't let the head win. Whew. How about if you got it in you? Let's give a little quarter turn to the right. Add a little gear. You can do one or two levels. Let's go. 95 to 110. Come on. You got this. Breathe in. Now you might feel that. 8, 9. On your 1 to 10 scale. You got it. Feel those legs. Come on. Beautiful. Still controlled. Bum should never bounce on your saddle. Always enough here. And we stay below 110 when we're seated. Right. It was horrid? Yes. 
okay? It's your last minute. So let's go. Last minute of sprints. And then we have a minute rest, all right? Awesome. 15 seconds gone. 15 seconds gone. 45 to go. Come on. Beautiful. Adjust again if you need it. Too easy. Add some. Too hard. Less. You want to try and do your best to take it through the whole class. If you can. Fifteen seconds left. Come on. Woo. Three, two, let's gear. One minute to go. One minute of rest. Grab that drink. The next one. Six. At forty-five seconds each. We're gonna do. See and climb. To sprint, 60 to 80. Standing climb, to sprint, 60 to 80. Seated sprint, 95 to 110. Okay? Each one has 15 seconds in between. So like, flush. And uh, there's only six of them. And then we have a minute. We'll take the whole song, actually. At the end, and then we'll switch it out quick and easy. Okay, I'm gonna give you another 20 seconds. Another 15, okay? So get yourselves ready. Throw that head out. You can do this. Okay? Five, four, three, two, seated climb to sprint. Add your gear. Let's go. First one. So seated, 60 to 80. Come on. Left ear, seated, 60 to 80. Come on, only six of them, you guys, 45 seconds each. Right there, come on. Woo. Staying below 80, above that 60. I like to beat. Left here. 15 seconds here. Whew. Are you ready? It's going to be a standing. 60 to 80. Add your gear. Up we go. Three. Let's go. 60 to 80. 45 seconds. Remember, if you need to sprint to move, sit and do it. Be where you're at. You can just uh, ride a flat. Be moved in though. We've got it. Bum back. This is your scale of one to ten, eight or nine. Whatever that looks like for you. Beautiful, come in. Beautiful. Have a seat, 90. 15 seconds. Whew, you do me in. 95 to 110 on your next. Let's go. 95 to 110. Whew. Hurry up, watch it. Breathe. Got there, halfway there. After this, there's only three left. One seated, one standing hill, one seated flex sprint. Three, 
three, two, slow it down. A few seconds. So seated flat or seated climb to climbing sprint. Let's go 60 to 80. So 60 to 80. Got that gear. Push and pull. Should be work. Come on. Three shoulders away from the ears. Tuck in those elbows. Don't think. Just let it hold. Let my head get rest me. Work in. We're to that body though. Halfway there. Halfway there. Come on. Woo. Bum back. Enough here. We don't want that bike to bounce. Control legs. On the back, feel that saddle. Cheek, cheek. Elbows are in. Shoulders away from the ears. You got this, it's gonna be awesome. Three, have a seat. That's here, 15 seconds. Whew. We have a last one. From 95 to 110, last. 45 here. Let's go. Beautiful. Awesome, everybody. Enough here. Come on. 95 to 110. Get to 110 easy. I bet you here. Breathe in, you got this. Not so good, right? Come on. Three. Woo. Quick drink, you guys. We're going to do one minute. Let's do a 90 to 100. One minute. Got that? Still feeling like some work. Not breaking that heart rate down yet. Got it. 20 seconds left. I mean, 40. I should have said 50. Got me today. That was hard. That was good. Good stuff. Look at those 
turns come down, just the bigger you're getting. It'll get a little bit more comfortable as it comes down faster. If you find that it's staying elevated for a really long time, maybe you might have worked a little bit too hard right at this moment in the class. Take it back a notch. It takes time to work up to working, you know, at that really high level. If you can ever get there. It's whatever your goals are, whatever you're looking for in your life, right? For me, I'm 46 and a half years old and I'm just here to stay healthy, to keep myself moving, be able to walk my dog and go boating and hiking with my husband and so that's where my goals are. You know, fight, fight aging in a healthy way, right? So, so whatever it looks like for you, whatever your goal is. If you're not sure, message me. You can chat about your goal. So you can find what you are looking for. What, yeah, what you want out of your, your life in the way of a healthy lifestyle. So, nothing wrong with that. You can always ask. I'm here for you. So slowly down even more. Stop. A little bit longer. So if you do have computers on your bike, I haven't talked much about it, but you can always check out. Um, you do know you've got a mine, my girl flex, I have my time, my calories, my speed, my average speed, my distance, and then my heart rate. So checking out all those numbers, if that's what you're looking at. I don't really do calories, don't really care. Okay, so if we're okay to come off our bikes, let's do so. If you're not ready, if your heart rate still feels up, you want to spin for a little bit longer, by all means, stay on the bike, join us after. Okay. So, if you're coming off. So, hamstrings, heel to the floor, then into the opposite leg, reach through this foot. You can either be on your seat, on there, and you're up here, you can be on the chair, wherever. Inhale up, exhale, fold, and reach. Breathing through, so really making sure that you're stretching out those legs. It looks pretty hard today. May not have seemed like a long ride, but it is a go for it kind of ride. So good job. It's very out of my comfort zone. I tend not to do a lot of drills, um, but I do it in the So thank you. And releasing that. We're going to stay on this leg. So grabbing onto that same ankle, pull the knee back a little bit. Good. So you can pull it all the way back and lean forward. As long as that knee's not pointing forward. It's either straight down or up behind you. So really pushing that foot into your hand. Really lengthen down the front of the thigh. Keep breathing in. Exhale. Try to push a little bit more of that foot into the hand. Lengthening that quad out. Right. And release. Let's take either crossing ankles, bring it up a little higher, all the way up. Hold on to your bike and sit back. So getting through that glute. Yep. Beautiful. So again, I'm going to give a little shout out to my cool down music. I've got Dave Gill um, out of New York. And then I have Emo Snow Angel with Dave Gill. Emo Snow Angel happens to be my son. So I'm a very proud mom, but he has been collaborating during COVID with people all over the world. So super proud mama. And release. Good. Other side. Heel to the floor, reach for the toes. Heel on the seat. Here, here, or up here. Oops. Good. Ooh, my quad went all the way up there. Deep breath in up. Exhale and fold. Ooh. A bit of quad yucky there. It's in life me for a moment. Pushing that foot into your hand and pulling it back. Really gentle now. So 
so I'll blow it a little more. This is my son wrote the guitar or mixed it and all of that. So, you know, good to be a proud mama. And release. So either crossing ankles, bring it up higher, all the way up, and then sitting back. And hold on to that bike and sit right back. Beautiful and release. Let's take that first foot that we were that leg we were working on. We'll take the foot back, toe to the floor, slowly lower the heel, make sure that back puts a straight line. And then reach forward from the heel out through the crown of the head. Good. So we're gonna slide that front foot forward a bit, drop that back knee down, tops of the toes to the floor, and then slide that front foot forward more. Dropping that back hip down. So super important, we stretch out those hip flexors whenever you spin. If you like, hands behind, pull them back, open through the chest. Awesome. And release. Stand it up. We'll switch sides. Toe the foot back. Toe to the floor. Slowly lower the heel. Reach long up through the heel. Drew the crown of the head. Slide that front foot forward a bit more, dropping that back knee down, tops of the toes to the floor, and then slide that front foot forward, and then dropping that back hip forward. Okay, so really getting that hip flexor hands together, round the back, chin into your chest. And release. And let's come right up. Beautiful hands straight up towards the ceiling, lifting up as tall as you can. Good, and release. And roll your shoulders up and back. Four, three, two, and one. And we're all done, everybody. Thank you so much. So please like, subscribe, share, uh, comment. Uh, you can always find me on Facebook or Instagram. So have a great day or evening. Thank you.